Hi, my name is John Jeffrey Smith. Uh, I never believed in ghosts before, but uh, now I do. It started one day when I was walking down the street and stepped on a piece of gum. I mean, I was just sitting there, a big pink blob of it. I instantly became enraged. I've been having a really bad day. The girl I was in love with laughed at me when I asked her out. At lunch, a kid bumped into me and spilled my lunch all over myself, and my teacher made me stand in front of class while he read the note I'd been passing back and forth with my best friend. So when the gum came into contact with my shoe, something inside me just snapped. I tore off my shoe and threw it, hitting an old man in the head. The old man was missing teeth and wheezed something at me. I don't understand old man language, though, so I just flipped in the bird and walked off. He pointed at me as I walked away from him. His hand was gnarled and wrinkled. His fingers were crooked and twisted. The nails on his hand were yellow with age and jagged. He needed a manicure bad. And maybe some lotion. When I got home, I kicked off my other shield and stormed towards my room. For a second as I passed the mirror in the hall, I thought I saw something out of the corner of my eye. It looked like me, but dead. My hair was greasy, my eyes black, and blood poured from my mouth and eyes. When I looked again though, everything looked normal. Eventually I sat in a spinny chair at my desk and put on some angsty music. Went straight to my Facebook where I had no new messages or notifications and started to poke everyone on my friends list. They were all on my friends list for games. None of them actually knew me, but it made me feel less lonely for a while. Suddenly, my door slammed open. I jerked around as it banged against the wall. My mum stood there staring at me. I stared back. Her mouth dropped open. What's the matter, mummy? Aren't I pretty? I asked her. She screamed and ran off, leaving the door wide open. I stood and closed her with a groan. Ever since these doctors put her on new meds, she's been acting so weird. So anyway, when I got back to my computer, I noticed I had an email. I opened it, totally excited. I never got emails that weren't spam. It had no subject, and all the message said was, I am coming for you. However, on the message was a piece of gum. It looked like the gum from my shoe. As I stared at it, it began to wiggle around and I noticed it was coming out of my screen. I reached out with a shaking hand and peeled the gum away from the glass. I sat there for a minute, unable to speak. The blob of gum stuck to my fingers like glue. About 30 seconds ago, my screen went black, and in its reflection I saw the old man I had hit with the shoe. He's standing behind me, holding a knife. He's slitting my throat as I type. I can see the blood on my screen, <coughs> but I keep going in hopes that this will reach somebody out there. Beware the gun man. He's coming for you next.